Hey, what's up? Not much, making sandwiches. Like to cook? I love cooking. Really? And this is commercial foods, where you can learn to cook anything your hungry heart desires. Hello. Nice of you to come. What can I do for you? How do my high school students sign up for this class? Well, uh, the first thing they need to do is see their guidance counselor at their base school. Uh, we also go out and do recruiting. Our school, uh, as uh, in general, the teachers go out to all the base schools and do presentations. Uh, and we just kind of recruit we want the best of the best. We want the cream of the crop. We want students who are interested in being at our school. In my case, uh, we want students that want to be in the food industry, restaurant business. Um, this class is important um, as far as my career goals because it gives me the basic setup of the steps that I'll need when I'm ready to go to the next level. This class helps my career in life because it gives me the experience I need to head on to my next goal in life which is to become a chef and open my own restaurant one day. How will this class help students in their future careers? Um, we are affiliated with Johnson & Wales University which I'm happy to say is one of the finest culinary universities on earth and our affiliation goes like this. If a student completes my program, a high school student completes my program over a two-year period and has a 3.0 grade point average or better, then they can go over to Johnson & Wales and carry credits with them from here. So in dollars, it turns into about $8,000 that they're saving, plus they graduate earlier uh, than the average student. Also, I'm happy to report that Johnson & Wales says that mm -hmm. our students are the best prepared of the high school students that come through their programs. I like this class because it helps give me the experience I need for my future and help with my career. Well, that depends on the student. What kind of jobs can they expect? Um, it all depends on what the student wants to do. I've had students that graduated this program and then have gone out into restaurants and run kitchens directly from here. Um, of course, a student like that, are the one, they're the ones that are working in jobs while they're going to my program. Uh, that's really the best way to do it, is to have a job after school or on the weekends, plus go to this program. Uh, I've, had, I've had students that are chefs, managers, owners uh, throughout the country. It really is, depends upon the student, how hard they want to work. It's, it's a tough business, this food industry, and it involves long hours, 
um, working on the weekends, working on the holidays. But if, if you're the type of person that really wants to work, that what, what they can expect is a great career, making a very, very good living. Marchman is important to me because um, not only does it teach us about different foods, but it gives us opportunity to learn about food history and the equipment that we'll be working with, and it prepares us for the next level of our lives. Briefly, <laughs> I can sit here all day and go on and on about how many different things we do in our class on a daily basis. But basically, in a nutshell, what we do here in commercial foods is we simulate what a restaurant is. We actually run our own little restaurant each and every day. We have business that's in-house. Uh, we provide uh, meals to the staff and to the student population. We do uh, many caterings throughout the area. Uh, for example, in February we're doing the father and daughter sweethearts dance for the Girl Scouts on two Saturdays. We're doing a big event for Leadership Pasco at the Hudson Library on December the 12th. Um, we do our school advisory breakfasts, we do big luncheons and dinners, and um, we simulate what a restaurant would be like on a daily basis and what a uh, catering business would be like also. That's what I mean. Since I found this class commercial food, now I can cook. I've been meaning to ask you this the whole time. What is the significance of the Frank Sinatra portrait on the table? It's the greatest singer of all time. Did I say that right, Mr. Kern?